John Rose. I have Parkinson's. My name is Gina Whalen. I'm 43. I consider myself a pioneer of multiple sclerosis because I was in a study. My name is Pat Erickson. I think that being on the study made me feel empowered, like I was doing something to make the disease go away. My name is Cynthia Rose. I'm his spouse and his caregiver. We were delighted to hear that there was this study. Our investigators are specialists and generally very well known in their field. Well, okay, now I want you to go ahead and tap each finger. What's wonderful about Evergreen is that uh, it is a little bit smaller institution. It really has a kind of family atmosphere. I can walk down the hall and find somebody when I, when I need help and talk to them, which is nice. The people are just pretty accessible here. Our coordinators uh, have been with us for years and they understand the disease process very well. I know as a study coordinator we are the first point of contact for the patient. Mm -hmm. And we always tell our patients here that call us and ask us anything that you want to ask us. Any question you have, please don't hesitate to call and ask us. Have you? No? Okay. Well, I met Marcia Merrick. She's so warm and friendly that she made me very comfortable right away. I have called her a couple of times. No problem. She'll meet you whether it be a Sunday or a Monday. The nice thing is is that you see the same person who works with you. The same people are always here to greet you, to take care of you. I find that I become so attached to the patients that I have on my trials that when the trial is over it's really kind of sad and kind of hard to let go of them. So all in all it's a very good team and patients feel very comfortable. It's kind of like putting a puzzle together. You have to have all these pieces fit together and then you get this study going. Being in a study for me uh, was a wonderful thing because it was my way of participating towards finding a cure for MS. We're not going to get any new drugs without trials. And we all want new drugs, new and better therapies. Our patients get a leading edge on really any new medication that's coming to market. I love my patients. My patients that are on this trial, I just love them to death. We got trials and trying something new. How are you going to find out? How are you going to cure it?